When he left the restaurant, when was the next time you heard from or about him? I got a call about two in the morning. When that phone rang, what were you afraid you were going to hear? He's dead. But the police said that we found Austin. And I was relieved. And two officers came over. I said, is this your son? Show me a picture of him in intensive care. And I said, yes. And they said that uh, he's in the hospital. <sighs> he's killed two people. The police come to your house. Did they describe what had happened at the scene of the crime? The police said he's killed two people and eaten them. And the blood that you see is not his own. Do you have any idea at all that he was capable of going off and doing what he is accused of doing now? No idea whatsoever. He's always been the kindest, caring kid I've ever seen. He always wanted to help people. He's always very, I call him the happy boy. The last two weeks, he started not being happy. He started being real serious. And what do you now understand took place at the scene of the crime? Two people were killed and one was wounded. How did your son wind up in intensive care? It's very puzzling because I read all the things about how they, they pulled him off the people that he killed and all this and that, but he was poisoned. He had his inflamed esophagus and stomach and his metabolites were way out of whack and he almost died. Man, I don't know what happened. The biggest question I have is, where did the poisoning come from? How did he get poisoned? I can't figure it out.